everybody and welcome to the last USA vlog. My brother's wedding just passed and I'm heading back to Korea tomorrow which is so wild. But before we get into this vlog, I wanted to introduce you guys to today's sponsor, Neiwai. They are a luxury lingerie slash loungewear brand. I'm currently wearing two of their products right now. This white shirt and this bra. This is my first time having a wireless bra. It is life-changing. It literally feels like you have nothing on and it's just so comfortable and it's cute because I can wear it like a crop top and just put a little shirt over it and just wear some like high-waisted pants with it and it's just so cute, just so comfortable, super just made to live in. The Barely Zero line has a lot of different colors on the website. I got it in the natural color as well. Let me show you how stretchy it is. It's like super stretchy. It's made from cloud fit fabric and I actually got it in another color as well. I got it in herbal green but that's gonna ship to my Korean address and I'm just gonna order a bunch of different colors. Order some for my mom because it's just uh, like I'm like raving about it. It's just so good. I'm gonna tell like everybody about it because I want everybody to experience this comfort. Neiwai also has a lot of cute pajamas on their website. They also have day wear and active wear as well and I chose this one white top because for me having a slouchy oversized white button-down shirt is my wardrobe essential. Like, I'm actually just gonna wear this to the airport because it's just so comfortable and I feel like for the plane I'm just gonna be like chilling. I was always really hesitant in buying bras online just because I don't know how it would fit well but you guys can trust me on this. If you get a bra from Neiwai, you will not regret it. This is so comfortable. I wish all of you guys could get it because it is just uh, literally life-changing. And I just want to share it with you guys. Like it's just so comfortable and I want to talk about it with you guys and just talk about like our first wireless bra experience. So you can get 20% off your first order with code Kian. So make sure to click the link in the description box. Check out what they have. I just want everything from there and all the colors. Thank you so much Neiwai for sponsoring this video and let's get started with the video. I'm back in DC again today and I'm at a cafe called 4 by Roasters. The weather is so nice that we just decided to sit outside. And they have a really beautiful blue smoothie bowl. It's so pretty, I don't want to ruin it. Ugh. Mm. This is a star fruit. Okay, so now I am on my way to go get some vegan tacos. Here I am. Chaya Tacos I picked it because I saw it on Instagram and I saw the interior and it was just so beautiful so I decided to come and plus they have vegan tacos and I love tacos and I love vegan food so Wow look at all these tacos I got one of every flavor to try everything <laughs> I don't know which taco is which. I think this is the mushroom one. Mm. Oh no, this is the eggplant. I think this is the sweet potato one. This is the mushroom one, I found it.
feels so good that the wind is blowing. It is so hot today. I'm currently in Maryland. We drove up about an hour to come get some peaches because it's now peach season. And um, I'm at an orchard right now and we have all these peach trees here. about America that Curry doesn't have, Trader Joe's. Back in college, I would used to love to buy flowers from Trader Joe's. Oh, these look so good. You guys, this is what I came for. I was obsessed with the Trader Joe's plantain chips. I would always get um, plantain chips in Ecuador and I just fell in love with it and I found it at Trader Joe's and I would eat this all the time in college and I'm so happy! Okay, so it is currently 8.33 in the evening and I'm out here because I want to look at some fireflies. In Korea, we don't have fireflies because they only live in um, very clean air environments. I always missed seeing fireflies when I was in Korea and stars too actually. So I'm here and I'm gonna look for some fireflies because they just bring back good memories and I think they're so pretty. Oh my gosh, I'm waiting for these fireflies to come out, but I'm getting bit by mosquitoes. Ugh. Ah, there's a puppy! Today is finally the day of my brother's wedding and it is also about three days until I leave for Korea so I need to get my COVID test done. I'm about to go to CVS and conduct a self test actually. They make you just put the swab in your nose by yourself. It's a drive through so I'm about to go right now and then come back and then get ready for the wedding. My dad made me an avocado bagel toast and he cut up some peaches for me. Just took a shower and eating before I get ready for the wedding. Mmm. My dad and my brother made it and it's so beautiful. Oh, you can't really see right now. It's a flower arch. We are all done with the wedding. It's kind of windy right now. This is what I wore. Just a lilac dress. Post wedding, my dad cut up some golden kiwis and brought us some watermelons. Mmm. Golden kiwi and my stuff. Almost done packing and I took a shower. I tried to pop a whitehead and it just 
didn't work out well so lesson learned don't pop your whiteheads but anyways it's dinner time and my mom she made me galbitjim and it looks so good she really wanted to make me this before i left and she prepared my favorite types of kimchi this is the cucumber kimchi and this is the scallion kimchi i think or the green onion kimchi This is the fruit that my parents and I bought at Lotte Mart in my previous vlog and I've never seen it before but it's called honey melon and I'm so curious as to what it tastes like Mmm Whoa It kind of tastes like a mixture of chamwe, the curry and melon the, that looks yellow, and a, um, what's it called? The green thing. The, not the cantaloupe. What's that called? Is it cantaloupe? Honeydew. It's called honeydew. I asked my dad. That's so interesting. It's not what I would expect. Hmm. But anyways, my flight is at 6.15 a.m. and we have to be at the airport by at least 3.30 a.m. I want to say. So might just stay up or something. I don't know. We'll see. I just said goodbye to my parents and now I'm just waiting for my flight. I am just so thankful for my parents. They really made this trip just so comfortable and so fun. I had so many good quality conversations with my mom and my dad. Yeah, they're just like my best friends. I'm very sad to say goodbye, but I think they're gonna come to Korea next year. So I'll see them in Korea next year. To Korea. I am at Incheon Airport right now. There was like such a long process in just getting out of the airport. So many quarantine things to do. And I'm just waiting for the quarantine bus to get back to Gangnam and to get home. I need to get another corona test done within 24 hours of landing. So yeah, I gotta do that. I still have some time left until the bus comes so I decided to eat at a Korean food place right next to the bus area It's only for people who have just arrived and I just ordered some ramen This bus is better than the airplane <laughs> Just got my corona test done at the Gangnam Pogwanseo and now they're taking me home in a ambulance. <laughs> right now I made it home this is the end of my USA vlogs thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video bye